for you all the way. She ain't let me break it down, yeah. She ain't let me break it down for you all the way. She ain't let me break it down for you. Call me punny, blessings, top blessings, equally make a little bunny. Speak my cup instead of running. And this ain't no gospel, but it got your spirit jumping. Yeah, I still can't believe it either. Yeah, I'm actually out right now buying a couple things. You know, we leave in a month, but that'll sneak up on us so fast. You know how it goes. That's not a bad idea. That's something I wish I had knew beforehand, because I definitely spend a little too much on some stuff. But you know I'd rather have more than not enough, man. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna hit you back a little later, okay? Yeah, we'll link up soon. All right. She just did Escape room. Hey girl. Hey, hey girl. Has she shown up yet? <sighs> Not just yet. And honestly, like, I'm just nervous because I haven't seen her in a really long time. And plus, she's been dodging all my phone calls and texts. And can you blame her? Not really. I just, I just want her to forgive me. All right, girl. I'll talk to you later. Come on, pick up the phone. Hello? What's up, baby mama? Uh, really? What you doing? I thought you were shopping. I was, but I'm just not finishing up, actually. Uh, you got everything you need? And make sure you send me the address to, uh, to your place so I can say things just in case. Because you're not going to get nothing. Uh, oh, sure hey, thing. I'm, I'm I'm oh, my God. That is not even why I called you. Alright, so what's up? So I responded to one of Rebecca's texts. Girl, you drunk as hell? What you gonna do that for? Well, she knows I'm leaving the country, and I just can only wonder how she figured that out. You're not talking to me like that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Because I did a post for you. I was just representing, you know what I'm saying? I was trying to show you off, be happy. Can I not be happy? Did I, you leave me? I didn't say that. Yeah, but she like friends with all her friends on Facebook. So what's up? Well, she wants to talk. I'm actually staring at her now, the spot we used to be at after class. So I told her we could meet up. So we actually at this spot we used to go to after class. Oh, please try not to do anything crazy. I mean, you my homegirl stuff. So I'm trying to back you out and everything, but you know. 
Yeah. Well, my fingers are definitely crossed, and I'm gonna talk to you later. Okay. Wait, hold on. Hey. Hey. You all right? I'm good. Yeah. yeah. How you doing? I'm okay. I yeah. hope you don't mind that I picked our old favorite spot. You know, actually I'm not. Cause you know, we spend a lot of time out here. Yeah, for sure. So, um, how you been? I've been all right. Been better, but you know, I'm just kind of rolling with the punches. What even made you drag me out here? Honestly, like, I can be real, it's it's kind of hard for me to talk about it, but I just wanted us to have a conversation before you leave. Have a conversation about what? Um, well, it's kind of hard for me to talk about. Excuse me. Hey, excuse me. Yes? I think you dropped something. Thank you so much. Yeah. What you doing out here? Taking a little workout? Just walking here. I get my exercise here. Okay. That's familiar. Do it? Yeah. I've seen you somewhere. Yeah. Have you been on TV? I, I, I was on TV uh, last week. Really? Yeah. Got a documentary coming out in Dubai. Okay. Mm. Maybe you have an IG or something? Really yeah. Can you put it in? Sure. Follow you. Only if you follow me back. This is it. Okay. If you check on there, you'll see some stuff about what I got coming up, too. All right. I'll keep in contact. All right. Really? What? Come on. I mean, like, you just, you just haven't changed one bit. What in the fuck is that supposed to mean? Come on. Like, you know how that shit unnerves me. What's the problem, yo? As a matter of fact, like, why in the fuck am I even here? Because you know I got other shit to do today. <laughs> okay, look, I'm sorry. I just... I just need you to talk to me. Rebecca, I don't even have all day for these days. <laughs> you heard me to the point where I didn't even want to live it yet. You sit here and judge me for being what I am without us even being together. If you trying to make me feel the small. And you know I'm one of the most highly demanded people in the city right now? Yet somehow you continue to fuck shit up for me. Okay, but wait a minute. Do you know how hard it is for people to call me and ask me about you, telling me that you're moving to Dubai for basically a year? And I don't even know all of this because why? Oh, right. You blocked me on social media. You won't answer my phone calls. You won't even answer any of my texts. Like, are you kidding me? But why am I here? You're here because I just, I like, I just need you to forgive me. <laughs> you kidding me? I'm serious. I know. That's why you got me fucked up. <laughs> okay. Are you done so we can move on? No. Really? Yeah. Yeah, really. You're there you left me with no notice. How you gonna clean out my bank account and take all three of my credit cards? Okay. Thank God. <laughs> Thank God I had a savings that you didn't even know nothing about. Okay, but you know that I wasn't even in my right mind. Like, I know I put us in a bad situation, but come on. All right, look. I'm really sorry. I know that I couldn't kick my drug habit and I didn't realize how hard those drugs were really getting to me, that I was hurting everybody around me. And I'm sorry at this point that I put you through a tough situation because I didn't mean to. But at this point, like, I just, I just want to clear up everything and just apologize so that we can close this chapter of all this unfinished business. I just want you to forgive me.
You know I didn't really even mean to say those things to you. I mean, it was my fault too. No, I was really being selfish because if I hadn't have said those things to you and made you mad, you probably wouldn't even gotten the car. Honestly, that's where this all started. Hey, babe, hey, come look at this. What is it? Yo, this nigga is so stupid. Hold on, just like. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man, he's dumb. <laughs> oh, where you going? I'm going to the library with Derek. Dress like that with makeup on? <sighs> All right, here we go again. I ain't know here we go again. Like, you know this dude got the huge crush on you. You keep feeding into that shit. Okay, we've been friends since, like, freshman year. And need I say more? First of all, ever since we first met, he knows I have not been into his kind, so you don't even have to worry. Yo, you dumb as fuck if you think he's not gonna try that shit with you. Okay, okay. Why are you like this? And matter of fact, like, why are you always like this with him? Because I know firsthand the comments he's made about me and his true feelings for you, but yeah, you keep taking his side. Wait a minute. I'm not taking no sides. <laughs> you know what? Whatever. The fact that you all dressed up, you got your face beat, yeah, that makes me even more suspicious. For real. Mm, I'm not even driving, so. Oh, that means so he pick you up. Yeah, he sure is. Okay, for sure. And he does not even walk his bitch ass up my driveway either. You know what? I'll drive myself. And that's fine too. Make sure you pack you a spinning night bag so you can stay with him because I would hate for you to fail your fucking midterms. Yeah, that's definitely when it all started. And I should have knew something was wrong when you here, but you just still asking for more relief. I mean, honestly, we both should have seen fine. I think something just kind of. I don't know, something just kind of came over me and I just kept going. You're not even really supposed to be here arguing. You're supposed to be catching up. What you been up to? Oh, so now you got time today. Oh, I'm not got a little time. Okay. Little time. I mean, you know, things have been good. I got a new job over out east. Oh, yeah, how that's going for you? It's going good. I mean, the pay's all right, but just the fact that I can get a little bit of money, you know, and Try to be like you on the next come up. So that means I'm going to get all my money back somehow, right? <laughs> cool. Maybe. Come on, work with me. <laughs> Yo. Just let it go. Samai means to be a forgiver, yet how can you forgive when you can never forgive her? Because you can't seem to forgive him, and you can't seem to forgive them for all the things they ever done to you. Funny, ain't it, when you can't seem to get a clue to even recognize what you're supposed to forgive and who, yet for some reason you're clinging on to your pain like the macaroni to the glue. So just let it go. What's that even supposed to look like, though? Crying nights, screaming with your chest so tight Feeling like your world is imploding because you want to let them know you right How they done you wrong, can't seem to listen to your song Even when you preaching like, man, why you hurt me? But don't you recognize hurt people hurt people They on a self-sabotaging spree So just let it go